see a lot fewer big rigs on the roads in the coming months. Nationwide and in Louisville, we are seeing a major truck driver shortage. Yeah, our Natasha Williams talked with the owner of a local trucking company about how this could affect your holiday season. We stay busy. We're, we're constantly on the road. 27-year-old Channing Mattingly has been a truck driver for five years. And just having that first paycheck <laughs> was a game changer for me, you know, and I always say either you're a truck driver or you're not. You're going to love it, you're going to hate it. <laughs> Mattingly knows all too well about the truck driver shortage. On Friday, I sat at a truck stop for six hours just to get two tires changed in a mud flap. That's, it took way too long. Uh, from a business standpoint and from my standpoint, I clock in at 3 in the morning and I didn't get to clock out till 7.30. Can you find enough truck drivers? Absolutely not. Employees are so hard to find and especially in the driver world. I, I would go as far to say it's no longer a shortage, it's a crisis. The American Trucking Association says there's a truck driver shortage of about 80,000 drivers, up about 20,000 since the pandemic began. But Summit says he believes that number is significantly higher. A little worse. Mm -hmm. um, I, I would venture to say maybe double. Double? Double. David Summit owns Summit Trucking in Clarksville, Indiana. Summit says historically there's always been a shortage of truck drivers, but since the pandemic hit, they've also felt the pinch in different areas. We can't buy or rent trucks because they're sold out. Uh, we can't get trailers. Trailers are especially a problem. Uh, and we don't really see any signs of things lightening up. And Summit says he's being told it could be 2023 or 2024 before his industry gets somewhat back to normal. And about those packages and Christmas gifts, well... I actually think it'll be fine, but, you know, there'll be some things that you can't find and there'll be some last-minute stuff and things that are on back order. But for Mattingly, the busier, the better for him and his family. And it's changed my, mine and my family's life. You know, I have three kids, I have a wife, and it's changed our lifestyle completely. And that's a positive that will keep him behind the wheel of this big rig for many years to come. In Shepherdsville, Natasha Williams, WLKY News.